hello friends in this video i will show you how to get the size of any file in kilobytes so here i have this simple file browser which contains a list view list view one and in on create event i search the external storage directory means i get all the files and folders from external storage directory so what I do is here I set the string folder to external storage directory and then I refresh list. In refresh list, here I have a string list and a list map. So I get all the files in this external storage directory to the string list. Then I sort the files and folders. And after that, I get all the files from list string to the list map using these this repeat block all the file paths from list string are added to list map using the key file and then I display the files and folders in list view 1 for displaying them in list view 1 I use get last segment path of get at position of list string list and I set it as text in text view 1 so this is how I get the text now when any item is clicked if the file path at that position is a directory then I set the folder to whatever position we clicked on and then I refresh list refreshing list will mean that it will it will clear both the list map and listing get all the files and folders to this listing and then from that listing it will again get all the files and folders to list map and display that in list view 1. So whenever I click on any folder it will display the files and folders in that particular folder. So this is about displaying files and folders and on back button press I check if the folder is equals external storage directory. If it equals external storage directory, then I finish activity. Else, I set a string up folder to folder substring 0 to last index slash of folder. And then I set the string folder to up folder and then I refresh list. So, this is on back button press. Now, I will tell you how to get the file size. I get the file size and display or and toast it here when list view item is clicked. So when the file path is not a directory, it means it is a file. So here I set, I have a string variable here called file path and file size. So here I set file path to get at position of list string list. After that I create a file called file java.io.file file is equal to new java.io.file file path. That is file underscore path is same as the string variable file path. Here I have created the string variables file path and file size. So first I create a file for that particular file path and then I set file size to string dot value of file dot length divided by 1024. Here this file is same as this file. I get the length of the file and divide it by 1024 so that will give me the file size in kilobytes. So I display this file size as a toast message by writing toast join files underscore size and kb. Now let me show you this. Here this is the external storage directory. All these are folders. Now in this folder dcim there are more folders and then there is this folder camera. When I click on this, I get so many files. When I click on any of these files, it will display the file size. Here the file size is 582 KB. This one is 1335 KBs. This one 1958 KBs. 1066 KBs. So in this way, we can get the file size. Here we have to create two string variables, then use this code and then we get the file size as string where which can be used anywhere so that's all in this video thank you very much for watching this